With good news for today from Baptist Press, I'm Brandon Porter. The March for Life Education and Defense Fund announced its full list of speakers for the 49th annual March for Life on January 21st in Washington, D.C. Marchers will be addressed in person by members of Congress, Down Syndrome advocate Katie Shaw, Duck Dynasty star Lisa Robertson, actor Kirk Cameron, and other prominent pro-life leaders whose stories will inspire marchers to build a culture of life. The theme for this year's March for Life, Equality Begins in the Womb, highlights how true equality is only possible if we recognize that children in the womb also deserve protection. The march has been held annually since the legalization of abortion through the Roe v. Wade Supreme Court decision in 1973. Moody Publishers has launched a new digital resource designed to support and expand their print publishing resources. The new site is called BibleToLife.com. The website contains hundreds of pages and articles aimed at reaching those searching for spiritual answers online. Launched in November, the site contains content written by authors like Tony Evans, Alistair Begg, Trillia Newbell, John MacArthur, and Priscilla Shirer. It also includes pieces from professors at Moody Bible Institute and more. The site is a combination of content adapted from previously released books from Moody and brand new content written specifically for the site. Articles covered at BibleToLife.com include topics like salvation, hell, heaven, sexuality, church history, spiritual disciplines, and mental health. Back with more in just a moment. Good news for today is made possible through our friends at The Voice of the Martyrs, a nonprofit organization that serves persecuted Christians around the world. Founded in 1967 by Richard and Sabina Wormbrand, VOM is dedicated to inspiring believers to deepen their commitment to Christ and to fulfill His great commission, no matter the cost. Find out more and sign up for their free monthly magazine at vom.org slash good news. Thanks for listening to Good News for Today from Baptist Press. LifeWay Research talked with 1,000 pastors in the U.S. to create what they're calling the 2022 Greatest Needs of Pastors Study. A total of 17 needs were identified. Here's the top five. Developing leaders and volunteers, fostering connections with unchurched people, church people's apathy or lack of commitment, consistency in personal prayer, friendship and fellowship with others. You can find the complete list in the story at baptistpress.com. Thanks for listening to Good News for Today. Find more news at baptistpress.com. Please make sure to subscribe wherever you listen to podcasts. I'm Brandon Porter.